I've already shuffled and we'll be taking a look at the recent past energy between you and your person. We'll see what's coming up for the two of you. We'll find out what the challenge is going to be and then we'll take a look and see what the outcome is. So Libra, the recent past energy between you and your person. We got the Page of Cups and it's with the Five of Cups. So this is telling me that um, your person, Libra, they could have been reaching out to you to have some fun. Page of Cups can be a very open-hearted type of energy. It can also it can be about intimacy. It shows a need to play, dream, have a little fun. Um, they could be feeling that you've been taking things way too seriously. Now, it's with the Five of Cups, so they know that you're disappointed about something. Yeah, or they could just be missing you if you two are apart. They feel like they know that some, that the connection is could be um, lost, so they're reaching out to you. Page of Cups can be about messages. Yeah, they know that you're you're disappointed. You're crying over spilled milk. Something happened in the relationship. Yeah, they reached out to you. They wanted to try to convince you to loosen up. Let's have some fun. So we move on over and we take a look and see what's coming up for the two of you. So we got this Four of Cups and it's with the Page of Swords. Well, the Four of Cups. The Four of Cups is, is actually about... Um, feelings of not accepting what your person is offering. Yeah, and just looking at the picture, if you look at the Four of Cups, the card above the word present, she's look, she's got, there's four cups there. There's one that's above her or at the top, and it's kind of floating, and it looks full, full of milkshakes or whatever that is. The cup is bright, it's white, it's got black dots on it. But she's looking down at the three cups. Below, below her. And the cups are, they've turned black. Yeah, they're black. And they, those cups were white at one time. Now they're black and the insides are blue. So your person, they, they're still disappointed. Libra, they're not accepting what you're offering. Yeah, not at all. They could be feeling devalued or unloved by you. And because the Page of Swords is here, they're telling me that, this is telling me that you could be um, someone that's younger than you, younger than them, because when you hear the word Page in the tarot, that can indicate a student, it can indicate youth, it can indicate immaturity. This is telling me that they see you on the the immature side or they feel that you did something that they really didn't appreciate. Because the page of swords is a type that will step on your toes. Or it could feel like they're stepping on your toes. The page of swords can be somebody that brings conflict. They'll stalk you. They'll do a lot of watching and keeping tabs on you. So this is how they're feeling. Yeah. So, like I said, your person reached out to you, wanted to bring some playful playfulness and fun back into the connection. You were still disappointed. And it looks like you're not accepting what they're offering. You feel that they're just... They do just stuff you, that silly stuff that you don't appreciate. Yeah. The challenge. Let's move on over. Well, we got the Four of Swords. Ends with the Two of Cups. Well, the Two of Cups, this is actually a good thing, the Two of Cups. And the Ace of Swords is telling you that you're ready to cut this person out. Eight of Swords cuts out. And it goes towards a new beginning. 
Yeah, you could have someone in mind that you feel would be better for you. Two of Cups is like the ideal partner. Yeah, it's a it's a deep connection. It's a union. It's a very romantic love, this Two of Cups. So you might be thinking of cutting this immature energy out of your life, going towards some new beginnings. Whenever you hear the Ace in the tarot, it's all about new beginnings. So this is telling me for some of you, you got someone on your mind that you you feel would be better for you with the Two of Cups here. But let's move on over. Let's see what the outcome is. So we got this Death card, the Death card, and the Fool card. So, yeah, Death card is about coming to a conclusion. Yeah, your person could be coming to a conclusion that you, you've cut them out and you've made this connection final. You finalized it and you've come to a conclusion. You feel like you lost interest. And that everything is different now. They feel that you changed. Because they see you going towards a new beginning. And they feel your energy is ready to just take a leap of faith towards someone else. Or just a new life or a new day. They feel you're no longer the same person that they met at the beginning of this connection. They know the truth. You're moving on and you've come to a conclusion about them and the connection and they feel your energy just about to take a leap towards someone else or just just a new day because the full card, the card that's below the word outcome, it can be someone that will run off. It can be someone that will just take a leap without thinking. It can be a risk taker. And that's how they're feeling that you could be thinking. And maybe they see it. Maybe you've already ran off to your two of cups. But that's the reading that I have for you, Libra. I hope you enjoy the reading. I hope it resonates. As you know, general readings, they do not resonate with everyone. Then again, if you like the reading, please comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. That way you'll be notified when I post my next reading. I'll also put a link below of the extended of this reading where I'll go over how you both feel about the situation, what's in the near future for the two of you, how you see yourself, best case scenario, and what will happen between the two of you. In the next few weeks, there's also a link below for personal readings if you'd like to try one of those. So, Libra, thank you so much for watching. I hope all of you are doing well and staying safe. Staying safe during this crazy virus season. Hang in there. It's going to pass. We'll all get through this. So stay strong and take good care. I hope you come back and join me for the next Libra reading just in case this one did not resonate. Maybe the next reading will. So Libra, thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah, I hope to see you at the next reading. I hope you have a great day and take care.